Dynamical gas undergoes a process P is equal to V0 into 1 plus 2 V0 by V the whole square the whole raised to minus 1 where P0 and V0 are constants. Change in temperature of the gas when volume is changed from V equal to V0 to V equal to 2 V0 is. In this question, the pressure P is given by P0 into 1 plus 2 V0 by V the whole square, the whole raised to minus 1. Okay, and we are supposed to find out what is the change in temperature that is T final minus T initial when the volume is changing from V0 to 2 V0. Okay, so in order to do that, let us find out what will be the corresponding pressure in both the cases, right? So initially, when volume is V0, let's find out first. So pressure is equal to P0 into 1 plus 2 V0 by, instead of V, we can substitute V0, the whole square raised to minus 1, right? So V0 and V0 cancels out. So what do you get? P is equal to, so 2 square is 4, 1 plus 4, 5. There is a minus 1 here, so it will be P0 by 5. P is equal to P0 by 5. Okay. Now here, the next condition we have to substitute 2 V0, right? So this will be P is equal to P0 into 1 plus 2 V0 by 2 V0, the whole square, raised to minus 1. So this will be what? So two, this gets cancelled out. So 1 plus, 1 square is actually 1. So 1 plus 1, 2, raised to minus 1, this P0 by 2. Okay. So we have got the pressure at V is equal to V0 and the pressure at V is equal to 2 V0. Okay. Now we need to find out the initial temperature and the final temperature. And for that we are going to make use of the ideal gas equation. From the equation we can write temperature T is actually equal to PV divided by NR. Right? So initially when volume V is equal to V0 we can write like this. P initial is equal to what is the pressure initially? P0 by 5. So P0 by 5 volume is V0 divided by nr clear and what is the final temperature t final will be equal to p is p0 by 2 finally so p0 by 2 what is v0 v0 is sorry what is v v is 2 v0 so 2 v0 by nr or this is equal to p0 v0 by nr clear so we have the initial temperature and we have the final temperature. Now just substitute it over here. Take the common terms outside. So P0 V0 by NR within the brackets final is 1 minus initial it is 1 by 5. So what do you get? This is equal to this is equal to 5 minus 1, 4, right? So the final answer is 4 by 5. P0 V0 divided by NR. Clear? So we get the answer as 4 by 5 P0 V0 by NR. Okay. So using this function which is given in the question, we found out what is the initial, what is the pressure, finally what is the pressure. Right? And based on that we found out the initial temperature and the final temperature. And we were supposed to find out delta T, which is final minus initial, and we are getting it as 4 by 5 P0 V0 by NR. Okay, I hope it is clear. Thank you.